when we are praying, I will see that lady who's wearing purple. Yes, stand up. You need to pray. These people who are trying to attack your sight, they must stop doing that. Amen. Yes, you feel like there's something that is moving. Yeah, it's true. Even, huh? even at home, they are staying with my cousin, which is a Sangoma. Huh? At home, they are staying with a Sangoma, which is my cousin. And she's telling them that they must go and train to be Sangomas. So, sister, they are defeated, these people. Amen. My name is uh, Nomosa Zongo. I'm staying at Leville, but I'm uh, coming from KZN. And what the D was saying that there are people that are trying to attack me is true because I am struggling to sleep at night. And another thing that is happening at home, my cousin came to stay with them. With them. Then after that, now uh, she's starting to tell them that they must go to train as as the Sangomas and. Uh, my parents, they died, and when they were dead, then we know that we have to pray. So at home now, they are no longer praying, they are not doing anything, they are not even going to church. So now then my cousin is using that thing then to attack them because he's seeing that now there's nothing that they are doing. So I'm praying to God that God must just help us with the situation, and I trust God that God is going to hear my prayers so that my cousin with that spirit of Sangoma must change and then believe that God is, a, is, a, is, is God is a, is a person that can help her with everything that is going to her life. Thank you very much. There are many things that they are happening in my life. Like uh, now, I was staying with my the father of my children and he left me from nowhere. So now I'm just staying with my children and even at home, there's nothing that is, is going okay. My sisters, they are struggling. There's nothing that is going okay for them. And then the, I, I built the house at home for my mother. Then that house, then I, I did not finish building it. So then all those things, they just disturb me. But I thank God for that because even now then I started my business and, and I'm praying to God to make it and then to be successful because I am praying to God so that at least I can get a quantum so that at least I can be able even to help them at home to be successful. Amen. Thank you. Yeah, rise up, yes. God wants to bless you. You must pray. You understand? God will give you your desire. Amen. Uh, because you, you have been praying for the family. Yes, man of God. Uh, say, God, why there's nobody who's chosen in my family? That's true. And then uh, if you choose one, you, go, you can choose one or choose me. Yes, man of God. Uh, because you know these people need to get out from what they are worshipping. Yes, yes, man of God. That's uh, true. Uh, you want God to intervene. Yes. Let me touch your heart in Jesus' name. I've touched your heart. Whatever you say, you will change this family in Jesus' Amen. name. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Good day. My name is Tsebiso from Johannesburg. I'd like to confirm the word the man of God gave me earlier during the service. Uh, how that when I pray, God hears me, especially for my family, because I've been praying for them to come out of things. They, they are idolatry. Someone has started being initiated. And then the man of God said he's praying for my heart that whatever I say will happen in their life. To someone watching this, I'd like to say there is God in Charis. The presence of God is here. The glory of God is here. You must not listen to other stories. Come and see for yourself. You will not go back home disappointed. I saw this pastor here. One, two. This one. Tobakari. Yes. I saw people fighting you. Yes, it's true. Huh? It's true. Yeah, I saw people fighting you. They, they will do everything, but you will conquer. Amen. 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 They, they want to destabilize the church. It's true. Huh? It's true. It's true. They just want to destabilize your church. Because I see them coming. I see them going out. As if they want to bring confusion in your church. Yes. 
uh, check what will happen this Sunday. This Sunday. God will silence them. Amen. God will silence them. Amen. Because I even heard that they are leaders. These people are leaders. Yeah, it's uh, true. Eh? It's true. So don't worry. Just leave them. God will fight for you. Amen. Absolutely. I greet you in the name of Jesus. My name is Pastor Tobagare. I came from Ellis Fontaine. Yeah, the prophecy that he said, uh, there are people who are fighting against my ministry, who are fighting against, it's true, it's true. In the ministry, there is a lot of attacks and some leader, they are doing some meeting to fight against me. Uh, there is a, they were fighting, fighting, fighting. But now, I thank God for the grace because now they can't stop me. As, a, as they said, through prophecy. I thank God. I, I can encourage many people that whatever they are facing, they must know that there is God. They must come and receive prayers. After receiving prayers, they will be delivered. Come and believe God. God, there is a grace here. Amen. I know God is going to help you, this brother here. This one uh, behind, yes, yes. Come to me. Stand there, don't come here. I want to pray for you. You understand? I saw a house that was divided. Okay. Huh? Um, I can't recall of any. Yes, you people here. You don't even know your relatives. Mm. You understand? And after this, this thing started with the issue of cows, cows, cows in the family. Yeah, the cows at her family. Huh? My, my granny left the, the cows, yes. Okay, yeah? My granny left house, cows at home. You had cows? Yes. And this divided the family. Right now, this family is divided now. And then you, you, you are born to lead the family. Yes, I'm the last born. Huh? Yes, I'm the last born. Yeah, the last born. Yeah, yes. To take over the family. But I want to tell you, there's nothing in your hands here. Yes. To prove that you can do anything. Yes. You understand? Yes. So today when I touch your chest, God will honor you. You'll overtake everyone. Amen. Touch your chest. In Jesus' name. Okay, my name is Isaac Mashapu from morning side uh, the men of God located me today prophesying telling me that like currently everything that I touch uh, they just I just lose everything but God is going to use me mightily and I will overtake my family he also mentioned the issue of cows that the cows are dividing us as family but God is going to use me to overtake everyone to lead and to overtake everyone in my family he also okay what I can tell people to say like don't lose hope. Uh, here at Charis, there is life. God is still in work. God is still doing miracles. God is still delivering His people. I can tell people to come and because uh, at Charis, there is, is a house of liberty. They'll be liberated if they come and visit here. I need to pray for you on the issue of Mary and remarry. Okay. You understand? Amen. Which happened in your forefather. Amen. So it must not happen to you. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Because you are praying a lot. Amen. So this is a curse you need to break. Amen. To hear from God. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. Uh, you break this curse. Amen. Go at home and pray. I break the curse of Mary and remarry in my family. Amen. You know what is happening. Amen. So I set you free in Jesus' name. Take it in the name of Jesus. You are blessed, you can go back. Uh, my name is Minister Fortune Mwade. Um, I came here to, as a visitor on the Wednesday service. Um, I'm a singer, I'm a minister, so I wanted man of God to pray for me about my career. But he touched something that was very important in my family. He said, in our family, we don't keep uh, marriages, which was true, because um, the firstborn in our family is in the second marriage, the second born is in the second marriage, the third born she's a woman, she's not married. The fourth born, my late brother, he died when he, uh, he, was, also, uh, he was also not married. So 
I'm the only one who is um, who is married in the first marriage. So when man of God located me, he says I must pray and I must continue praying. I thank God for that because I think he has he has located the root of what I'm going through. It's not what I, I wanted him to pray for me. But I thank God for that. I just want to encourage um, uh, some other people. When you are going through a lot, God can always locate you. Just keep praying. But you must be connected in prayer. Because you can't be connected to God when you are not praying. When you are not, when you are not uh, praying, you must be praying. Then you can be connected to God. With these few words, I say thank you so much. I see that brother there. In the name of Jesus. Brother, you are free there. The brother in front of you. This brother in front of you. Come, brother, you are healed. I'm seeing a disease that was in your father. You hear me? A disease that was in your father is in you now. And the disease that, that is in your stomach. Hey, hey. Huh? I never twenty eighteen now. Uh, interpret for me because I can hear. I was sick in 2018, but right now I just feel some objects moving in my stomach. I say I'm hearing the same thing that this thing used to happen to your father. Oh, okay. You understand? Okay. Uh, because I see your father falling. Okay. You understand? Yes. And uh, from there, something was moving here. And when I asked, they said there was the same thing. Okay. So touch your stomach there. Moving object. Out. In Jesus' name. And this thing is the one that is holding your progress, brother. Yeah. You understand? Okay, pastor. Uh, because you, 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 you love to work. Okay. But there's nothing to work. Yes. I, I set you free. In Jesus' name. You build a house in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are blessed. I see a brother there behind. I need to pray because this is spirit, brother. You hear me? You are praying a lot. You are praying to hear from God. It is true. Huh? It is true. You are praying because Amen. there was a time you said, I don't want to do things. That God didn't tell me. It is true. It's like uh, you, you are you are afraid of God. Yes. Eh? It is true. Uh, and then you are here, and you're asking God, speak with me. Amen. Speak with me. If you are, this man is a man of God, must speak with me. Yes. Eh? Yes. I want to pray for you. I want to pray for you so that God will speak with you. Amen. Because there were dreams that were bothering you. Yes. Uh, you were asking yourself, if I'm called, why do I dream these dreams? Yes. Eh? Yes, it's true. it's true. But I want to pray for you and cancel these dreams. Amen. You are free today. Amen. You will hear from God in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. God bless you. Come here. Let me pray for you. I want to touch your chest. You are back. Now let me touch your chest in Jesus' name. You are blessed. The issue of marriage to that brother, we need to pray for it. You hear me? The marriage issue. There's a brother at the back there. Yes. We need to pray, brother. Yes, man of God. We must pray for marriage. Yes, sir. You hear me? Yes, sir. Uh, you, in your family, you don't keep marriage. Yes, it's true. Huh? It's true, sir. There's a problem. True. That in your family, you must have a child there, child there, child there. It's true. Huh? It's true, it's man of God. So we must pray for marriage. We are praying for the whole family. True we are setting you free. The Amen. whole family will be free. Amen. Because you are here. Amen. God bless you. Thank you. My name is Tsepo Tembalishike. I'm currently residing in Olven Hotbosch. I got the, uh, the prophecy today from the man of God saying that there's a problem of marriage in my family.
and uh, the devil just wants my family to have uh, kids here and there all over uh, without any marriage. Yes, I can confirm that prophecy is true because uh, this thing came very far uh, from my grandfather, from my uh, my uncles, my aunties. So it's something that is in the family. And I therefore confirm that is true and I thank God for delivering me and my family. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, uh, the, uh, the prophecy is true and as a result of it, I've been, I'm having a difficulty in getting marriage and, and I've been trying uh, here and there and things were not working out and today I believe that my family is free I am free and I therefore want to take the opportunity to encourage those who are facing such similar situation where you find that um, uh, there is a problem of marriage in the family that yes the solution is there God can see each and everything and when we come to him in faith, he can be able to deliver us, give us the solution that we need. It doesn't matter uh, how far or how long the situation has been. God is able. God is uh, able to, to, to provide the solution and make sure that we are free and we are able to serve God, not only individually, but as a family, because he's a God of family. Thank don't, you very don't much. Don't travel home. What is it? Now, brother, don't travel home. You hear me? Don't travel home. You hear me? Yes, did. When did you go home? I'm from Guyan today. Eh? I'm from home today. Don't travel home again. Okay, did. You understand? Yes, did. Because these people are attacking you uh, from home. Yes, did. You are, take a year. Don't travel home. Okay, thanks, did. You hear me? Yes, did. Eh? Yes, because did. since you travel home, when you wake up, when you sleep, something press you down. Yes. Eh? Yes, did. Now you went home. This thing can be more. Let me pray for you. Come. These people are attacking you. You are innocent. You understand? Come, come, oh, come, 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 come. Leave him, you spirit. Leave him. Leave him. In the name of Jesus. Leave him. You can't beat him with a stroke. Come out in the name of Jesus. Leave him. In Jesus' name. Rise up, rise up, brother. You are free. Brother, before you travel or when you sleep, they come and press you down. Eh? Tired always eh? when I wake up. I feel tired when I... And when you wake up, you are very tired. Yes. You understand? I was telling my cousin. Eh? I was talking to my cousin that day. I don't feel good always. You don't feel good? Yeah. So you went home, they attack you then. It will be worse. So we have stopped this thing. I mean that. Spend a year without going home, you will be successful. Thanks, but the attack dude. is from home. Thanks, dude. Yeah, God bless you. God bless you. You'll make it. God bless you. I wish uh, uh, Advocate Novella, let's advise him, he must not go home. Uh, we need him to live here. There's life here. You'll make it when you're here. God bless you. I'm seeing this lady here. There's a demon. There's a demon there. Come. Yes. The lady here. Yes. I'll see this one here. Behind you, there's a brother, come. Touch your stomach in Jesus' name. That thing must come out of your stomach. Come. Touch your stomach here. I set you free. Come on. Come on, you spirit, leave it. I'm seeing this one here. Yes, come. Run forward here. Come, run forward, run forward. Jesus' name. This spirit must leave you. You have a demon. You have a demon. You must leave. I'm seeing this thing that is happening to you. Come. I've been looking at you today. I heard that you must be free today. 
Jesus name. Come out, you spirit. I'm seeing that lady. You come. You. One, two. You are close to Nancy. Come. Run forward here. Be free in the name of Jesus. Be free. Leave that womb in the name of Jesus. 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 I put a baby in that womb. I put a baby in that womb. Can you come here, you sister? Run here, run, run forward, run forward. Go that side. Be free as you are running in the name of Jesus. Be free in the name of Jesus. Spiritual husband must leave you. That spiritual husband must leave you. That spiritual. I'm see that brother. I'm see that one. Can you just come here? Come say. In the name of Jesus. Run forward. Be free. Jesus. I'm see this one here. You sister. This behind. Come. You are free. You are free. Yes, you are coming here. Be delivered in the name of Jesus Christ. This thing must leave your stomach. In the name of Jesus. I'm seeing this mama. Yes, stand up mama. One, two. Yes, stand there. Don't come here. You are free there. In Jesus name. I'm seeing that lady there. You are looking at me. Rise up behind there. The lady there. Rise up. Come. You are free today in the name of Jesus. Listen, my sister. Uh, God wants to bless you. I think I remember this lady. Uh, God wants to bless you. Amen. But you need to have secret. You heard what I was saying Amen. about secret. Amen. Because many people are not happy. That's in, true. In your family. I see true. people talking. That's very true. Uh, against you. That's very true. You understand? So you don't need to tell anybody what you are having. Go fight for you. Amen. I'm hearing that I must pray for you, for your mind. Amen. Uh, because they are trying to attack your mind. Amen. You, you are starting to forget things. Yes, I'm forgetting. Huh? I'm forgetful. Uh, I set you free. Amen. In Jesus' name. That pastor can come. My pastor come. Come here. I set you free in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name. You are anointed, say, so you are anointed. You are anointed, you are anointed. In Jesus' name. That brother, come. Yes. The spirit of snake must leave you. In the name of Jesus. For that brother, I've prayed for him. Can you just come here? There's a lady here. Come. Run forward here. You are free. You are free from this demon. Can you just come, you say? Yes. In Jesus' name. Come on, come on. Leave him, you spirit. Leave him, you spirit. In Jesus' name. I'm hearing that you always plan. You always plan it's true, man of in God. businesses. It's true, man of God. Eh? Yes, I want to start businesses. But, but there's nothing that is becoming successful. Yes. Eh? It's true, man of God. Uh, you were suspecting witchcraft. Yes, yes. Huh? Yes, true. So don't suspect anything. Leave everything to God. Amen. Amen. Go fight for